guys i figured that i like to chop live in lagos and i don't even get to take you guys along so today let us visit three cool restaurants that you can have fun and that you'd love in lagos let's go <laughs> Lagos today. Oh, I forgot, guys. Let's do a quick outfit check before we go. So, I'm wearing this two piece leather and it's really pretty. Carrying this Dior bag and my sandal heels. I look really beautiful and I'm on braids, you guys. So, yeah, just wanted to show you guys my cute little outfit and let's go. Welcome to Soho guys. They actually launched like three days before I came and the first thing that caught my attention is that rooftop that has that striking resemblance with Omar. But guys, look at ambience now. This, this is so beautiful. You guys were here already and it has and immediately brought the menu i was like okay because everything like on the menu looks really relatable like they're easy to know oh, this is cool i ordered for a white wine and it came like as swift as possible it's actually like a very new restaurant so they're still trying to like do their stuff and my food came you guys when i tell you that this food this food is the real mvp i love it guys this is just me sipping my white wine and just you know trying to get comfortable in the restaurant so it is called the islander rice my god my goodness get me lit i loved every piece of it guys you guys this food is a 10 out of 10. I'm still clearing my plate out or my pineapple. <laughs> my pineapple plate out. Why is my food finishing? I am a chosen. I am a chosen. I am a chosen. Can, this, can my plate get refilled? Like, this food is too good to finish. Mm. Too for my money. Trust me to check the restroom out. Actually, looks like really good. And I forgot to mention that they're sharing like restaurants up and down. I'm still gonna get back into that. But guys, I hate trash cans that you have to use your hand to lift. But then back to what I was saying, the restaurant has like up and down. So upper part is like I called Agbeke. It's like a local dish part. And yeah, that's it. Love this beautiful decor here. It's so beautiful. I had a good time at Soho. You guys, I have a Guys, I'm gonna reach Soho a 8 over 10. Ambience beautiful, customer service great, food amazing. The space, guys, if you're looking for like restaurants that you can go and they wouldn't exactly restrict you from taking pictures, Soho is the place. Like people are just taking pictures, but I just hope people don't start overdoing it. But guys, 10 over 10, 10 over 10, loved it. So guys, the next restaurant we're visiting is Zaida Lagos, and you thought you saw aesthetic at Soho, right? Look at this heavenly decor in Zaida, you guys. This is beautiful. This is amazing. I walked in. I'm like, okay, you guys know what you're doing. Like, let us get into the details. The table, the finishing, it is beautiful. Then you have this upstairs part too. So I checked the upper part. You know, the decor, furnishing everything like tastefully finished this restaurant is beautiful but i later like went downstairs i just kind of like preferred to eat downstairs but you guys i just had to check that upstairs out see now see how beautiful it is i loved it and guys i just like picked a seat settled down so i ordered for a chicken pizza and pon martini i just wanted something light and this took about 15 minutes i suppose why is it that Restaurant pizzas are always so flat. Why? I love how this wall painting is giving the old cream aesthetic a contrast. It's beautiful. And of course, we definitely have to check the restroom, guys. So the restroom is just like simple and beautiful. It just has this black and white wall painting and everything. Nothing serious. It's cool. So I just went back, grabbed my bag, and I left. You guys, I had a good time at Zeta. It was really beautiful. It was really cool and cozy. Of course, it's an aesthetically pleasing restaurant. I'm going to rate them a 7 over 10 overall. 
the third restaurant we're visiting is called koi and koi is not a very new restaurant like the other two and koi is a japanese restaurant i've been here a couple of times and trust me when i tell you that koi is a very beautiful place to eat and just chill i'm here already and i look you so saw so for starters i'm having a buri salmon bowl and it doesn't add the sushi i loved loved it i don't know about you but i love my sushi cooked like well cooked you get i mean maybe it's the nigerian in me but i loved it and i had this drink called going banana it was fabulous but you see my main meal i hated it with passion like like can you take this food back and run me my check back okay i don't like this i do not live for this my first impression is really bad but well, i just want to try it one more time to see if i'm gonna get it under this okay I do not leave. I do not like. I do not leave for this place. Okay. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I don't know. I'm just gonna have my drink. I made a very wrong choice. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna eat my sister's food. But she's happy to be in the black. Right. This is another part of my starter, guys, and it is called Born Like You. You guys, this is a 10 over 10. I love, love this. I'm definitely trying this again and again and again. I just want to give it a second chance. Maybe there's a way. Maybe there's something that I'm missing out. say it's about the restaurant but i'm gonna say it's about the food i ordered for i do not like it i'm just gonna have my shoes but my starters did it for me i love love this so for tonight and my experience in total i'm gonna rate koi a 7 over 10 the starters did it for me for the food but my main dish i did not like my sister's own was good and yeah that's what's up guys thanks for watching so which of the restaurants did you like the most easy zeta easy soho easy koi which one is your vibe let me know in the comment section guys mm -hmm.